Hey, aspiring authors. Okay, it's almost the end of the day for me, and I am like laying in bed reflecting on my day, and I wanted to come on here and tell you guys like the most unbelievable story. So as a lot of you may have noticed, people have really been getting a lot of luck with getting on shows just by like the mere energy going on in this group, which is like kind of unbelievable, right? But today I had the most craziest thing happen. So some of you may know but that I've been trying to get on Impact Theory, which is actually like one of my favorite shows like on earth. I mean, next to Oprah, it's Impact Theory for me. And I love this show so much. I it's just a huge dream of mine. And um, I had asked, I was on another show called Can I Pick Your Brain with Daniel Geffen. And I actually asked him at the end of the show if he knew anyone over at Impact Theory. Well, it turns out he did. And this was a few weeks ago. But he um, sent a message to the producer of the show. And, off, and the producer of the show wrote back and offered to have a phone call, which happened today, which is awesome, right? But that's not the story. That's not the crazy twist. Here is the crazy thing that happened. So yesterday, Daniel had asked me if he could have a phone call with me because he needed my help with something. And we got on it and um, I told him he could go ahead and record it in case he wanted to like listen back to it later. And he's looking for like a creative assistant and all of these things. And he was going through like some super... Um, barrier beliefs um, in his own mind about being like embarrassed about the amount of money he could offer. And anyway, I'm going to post the, the entire call in um, the Fearless Ambition group. Maybe I'll even post it in here if you guys want to see it. Because So here's the crazy thing that happened, all right? Because I don't want to get all boring with this, this story and this live. So it turns out Daniel took this recording of our coaching call that we had yesterday and he posted it in his in his private Facebook group, which is ultra private. And it is um, where he is like, he calls it bare naked business. So he's, he's basically doing the Gary V thing, like exposing himself on so many levels. So two things happened as a result of this. Number one, it turns out that the producer of this show from Impact Theory is actually one of, out of, out of a, 8 billion people on the planet. There are 150 people on this group, in this group, and turns out that this producer of the show happens to be one of those people. I mean, what are the odds that like hours before I'm going to have this phone call with this guy that there's this video with me and Daniel just talking about problems Daniel's having. I had no idea Daniel was going to post the video. I mean, none whatsoever. So then another thing happened. Uh, it wasn't, if that wasn't good enough, which it actually was, I know like, <gasps> like, are you freaking kidding me here? Like the universe is such a magical thing. So the other thing that happened is, um, today I was doing a Facebook live with my friend Heather and she's actually one of the aspiring authors. And we were talking about her worthiness formula, which is A plus B plus C. And I highly recommend you guys checking out the video, by the way, because Heather is just amazingly brilliant. And her take on worthiness is not like anything I've ever heard before. So by the time I get off the Facebook Live with Heather, I've got this message in my Facebook inbox from my buddy Chris. Now, my buddy Chris is this super interesting guy that I know through my, like, all my Tony Robbins connections, and he and I had volunteered together at a Tony Robbins event, like, years ago. Anyway, so he messages me, and he's like, hey, saw the video with you and, with you and Daniel, and he called me. Well, it turns out he is... <laughs> He's telling me like, oh, my buddy just sold his company for $180 million and we're going to go out to LA to hang out for a week and tour the Bulletproof Studios uh, or Bulletproof Coffee, like they're getting like a back-end tour of this. And I'm like, that's so cool. So if you don't know what Bulletproof Coffee is, like this is Dave Asprey, who is like, he's all into biohacking and all of this really cool stuff. 
and that I am super, super duper into. So it turns out now, just because of one video that was posted in a Facebook group, number one, this producer got to see me in action. Number two, my buddy, who's like going to introduce me to a guy who just sold his company for $180 million, and I might get to meet Dave Asprey. I mean, how is that for momentum for one day? That is just one day in the life of Mary Shores. <laughs> Irene, I love Bulletproof Coffee too. And by the way, the whole reason I'm going to LA um, is because I am going to go do a live taping of a radio show in LA called Renegades. Then I am going to visit the Hay House headquarters and actually teach them a workshop. And then third, I am, <laughs> thank you, sweetie. Third, I am going to hang out with my business partner, Cheryl Muir, the other half of the aspiring authors, um, at this event called Amplified Soul, which I am so crazy excited about because um, it's all about like leadership for emerging leaders in this spiritual thought community. You know, I'm seeing a lot of crazy stuff out there. Like I'm seeing a lot of I'm seeing a lot of people um, coin themselves as spiritual leaders and spiritual entrepreneurs who are doing nothing but selling get-rich-quick schemes. And I don't think that any of us want anything to do with that. Like, to me, there's no integrity in, in that because, like, what we need to be doing is always giving ourselves and of service. And when you do that, like... Like, listen, this call I had with Daniel yesterday, he wasn't paying me. I didn't even have time to talk to him, but I did it out of like wanting to help him, wanting to serve him. And also Daniel um, is going to be giving us an interview for the upcoming podcast class, which I finally came up with a um, title for. Actually, the powerful Roxanne did. So it's going to be called... Featured and fabulous, either that or fabulous and featured. Anyway, the five-phase formula to booking your podcast. So, all right, well, listen, I just could not type out that entire story, and I will, Roxanne downloaded the video for me, so I'll post it in here, and I'll also post it in Fearless Ambition in case any of you guys want to check out my coaching call with Daniel Geffen from Geffen Media Group, who is just this awesome human being that lives in Israel. Anyway, I love you all. Massive love. Um, thank you so much for, uh, thank you so much for tuning in while I'm in my jammies. And I hope that all of you continue to share your wins. I mean, the massive progress going on in this group has, it's just been overwhelming. And um, I love it when I see you guys post that you got on the show. I love it when I see you guys tell me that you got a download for your content. I love it when I see you post that you've made some uh, progress on your proposal. And by the way, I know how hard it is because I'm writing a proposal now too. So I am writing a proposal for a book called The Communication Code. And you know, like I've been writing it for months. I know it's difficult, but I want to have it done before March 1st so I can give it to Hay House when I visit them. All right, see you later guys, bye bye. Hey, this is Mary, thanks so much for watching. Check out a free chapter of my book, Conscious Communications at maryshores.com forward slash free chapter. The link is in the description below.